Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of um, of Gamers Blitz. So today we're going to be talking about a very simple game, and it's called Pass Play. It's a very easy game. Um, so Nathan and I we played it. That was weird. He messaged me just now as I said his name over a couple weeks ago, and I. From what I understand or quite remember, it's called Pass Play, okay? Pass Play. Excuse me. And playing the game each, oh, uh, ever if each dot rolled means one token you don't give, three dots is a perfect roll. If you just have one or two tokens left, players with no to tokens aren't out of the game just yet. They just have to pass on their turn to the next player, and who knows, they might just get some tokens back. The last player with tokens wins and gets to collect all the tokens and that are in the center right. Uh, so it doesn't say how many we started. I can't remember. Oh, right, we split them in half. So, there's these tokens here, okay? Um, I'm gonna try. So, there's 24 tokens. Sorry, I was trying to think of how... Oh my god. Um, how it works, just trying to remember. Just so you know, this is kind of like, you could probably play this on your own, beat the devil, but it does say two to four players, so I wouldn't play it on your own, unless you wanted to. Probably good. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, four, nine. Okay, so I need three more tokens for this tour. Okay. Three more tokens. One. Uno, dos, tres. Okay. So there's 12. So say there was a second player with me, they would get 12, which is in here. And then I have 12 as well. Of course, out of the bag, obviously, right? Um, okay, so I have my 12. And maybe, uh, I don't know how we could do this. Whenever there's dice involved, it gets tricky, but that's okay. Well, we'll do this. So, okay, here we go. So there is three dice, okay? Three dice. One, two, three. Okay? So then you're gonna first person who goes first is you could I think you could just really make that uh that rule up on your own, whether they, they're the youngest, the last person who pooped, whatever that is you want for them. So you're gonna roll it. So uh, I can't do that. Okay, so basically I'm gonna just kind of show you the best I can. So how there's the dot there, the right, the left. Okay. Sorry, you saw my finger there. So you got the right, you got the left. If it's two players, ob obviously you just give two your tokens to the player across the circle. You don't give anything to anyone. Okay. So of course they get the two co tokens or the player to your left gets the to one token and the player to your right gets another. This game could probably go on a long time if you have more players and sometimes it goes on a long time if you just have two of you because that happened to me and Nathan. So, let me go again. So I got three circles, right? And that just means that we don't get, um, you don't get any, you don't have to, you don't have to give any. So like the next player, sorry, it's the next player's turn. They got three circles and they don't have to give any of theirs. And then if oh you got three left, so you gotta give three to the left. Again, three circles. So this one here, the star, you just throw a token in the center. If you get two one or more, depending on how many stars you get, you get three stars, you gotta throw three in the center, two stars, you gotta go put two in the center. And you're trying to win um, to get to the most. Uh, tokens in the end or I don't know if it's like if you're all out of tokens or however that works but we just did it till one of us was out of tokens because I wasn't too sure how else 
or other ways you've played. So let me know if you guys have any games or rules below of your own ways of playing this, if you've played it before, what you thought of it. Super simple game, six plus, and then two to four players. So anyways, that is it for me. You guys have a wonderful, oh, and then this is the game if you haven't seen. Um, but you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and we'll chat soon. Bye now.